so welcome to another video. So I'm sitting in the van in, uh, in Cheryl Car Park in Kinlochew and I'm just waiting on my two pals Anne and Beverly arriving. And we're going hopefully to do three of the Fisher Fields tomorrow from Kinlochew. So we're going to um, walk in to the end of Loch and Fada um, this afternoon and camp somewhere at the end of the walk overnight and head up the three of rows tomorrow and then walk back down to camp. <clears throat> oh, there they go, that's them arrived. Um, so, really looking forward to it and I'll just show you on the map what I'm doing. So, I don't know if you can see. Oops, put that here. <clears throat> but, um, we're here. So tonight, we're walking up here, all the way up here, all the way up here, and we're going to camp round about here. And tomorrow, we're doing this route here, up Ben Tarson, up Malach, Cor McFerrahe, down the other side, up Strobban, and then we've got to come back over the middle Monroe again and back down to where we're camping. So, a big day. <laughs> But I'm um, looking forward to it. Hopefully the weather will be okay. Um, it's been absolutely rubbish, but um, it's supposed to improve tomorrow. So I can't get a forecast from this car park. Not enough reception, but um, hopefully it'll be okay. Cool. There they are. That's us just about ready to leave on our trek up to Loch and Fada. And it's pretty windy, um, so hopefully that'll ease, but there's a blue sky. So, not too bad. So we've arrived at camp and um, that was about a seven, seven and a half mile walk from Incheryl uh, car park at Kinlochew and it was really nice and sunny to start with and then the rain came on it just got heavier and heavier. So we've all here helped each other pitch the tents and um, Beverly's got the MSR as well which is um, the inner pitch first so 
um, managed to get the tents up without too much water coming in and just having dinner now so I've got some water um, and it's kind of a soggy um, camp spot um, everything's wet because it's been so much rain um, but it'll do so I've got the bed and everything sorted so I'm just going to have dinner cool cheers thanks to Beverly she's brought me a wee bottle of Sauvignon Blanc and pasta bolognese that was just off in the blow about the look of your sunglasses <laughs> Morning, Anne. Good morning. I had <laughs> fab sleep and I was cosy wozy. Beverly, how are you? Oh, wonderful. We've had a soggy night. Like my We've bum's wet. Soggy and a really soggy night. My sleeping bag's a bit damp. It's because the, the ground here is so uh, spongy, but it's probably the best of what's about. You can see over there. So the rain's off. It's been raining all night. It's been really windy all night. I think that might be the back of Sleach up there. Um, and that's our hills up there. So, don't look too bad. I'm gonna go and get some breakfast. beach down at the end of Loch and Fada and our tents are quite near there but it's clearing up yep. definitely clearing up um, that's Leoch up there and that's where we're going up the left hand side of that river and uh, obviously that's not the summit of Ben Tarson I wish, wish it was it's I'm not sure are we up the back I think um, so yeah soldiering on he says we need to go that bump to get here, don't we? Do we? Probably. Um, no sure, Anne. Mm. <laughs> we're a bit damp, but hey ho. Yeah. Just a bit. We're happy enough. <laughs> Ben Tarson up there. That's a bump we've got to go over. And just beautiful. You can get a view down to the lock. I don't know if that's still locking Fada down there. <sighs> Lovely. Look at that. Wow. Sleok over there to the left. Lovely. So nice. 
and the rain straight off. There's the wee bunny. Right here in the rock. Oh, look at the hair. Oh, I don't know if you can see it with the GoPro. I know, it's so well blended, isn't it? You're heading right that way, will I go towards it? I okay. didn't want to scare that. I think it's frozen in. Right, it's going to be hard. Hello. Yeah, it's losing its white. It's losing its white, it's winter coat. Yeah. Just about at the top of is it Malacormac Ferry, something like that. The middle Monroe, which is the highest. So a bit more. It's hard to tell in the mist how far I've got to go. The girls are just coming. With all these boulders, but it's actually a pretty good path all the way through them. Malakar McBerry. I think that's how you say it. Another one fed to dust. Oh, how many have I got left, girls? I've got six Hello. minerals left! Hey, hey. Six minerals! Oh, nearly fell over. Oh, God. Cool. This is the highest in the three that we're doing. But I think that head is Skurban. So we're nearly down at the Bilak. Girls are just coming, taking their time. It's got a slippy path. So, hopefully this is a sign it's going to clear up. Cool wee ridge comes off um, Malakor McFair. Here we saw that coming up, um, and we're heading way back down there. But yeah, it's coming and going. At least we've seen something. Right, better head off. Oh, my tongue might be horrible. Mm, your tongue's horrible. Linda heading down from Munro 3. We we'll have to reascend that, which is Munro 2. Doesn't seem fair. We've been up and down that, I've got to go back up and down it again. So over there, we've just noticed we can see the tennis court. Uh, that's Ben Tarson. And to the right is the tennis court. There's a couple of people coming along the ridge here. Looks amazing. And there's Beverly at the summit. Hello Beverly. Hello Anne. Hello. I am doing some stretching. <laughs> Recommended. For a couple of people in the it. mist. Lovely. Yeah. It's closing in again, but I'm happy we got some views. I saw the tennis court, so that's made my day. So that's Ben Tarson over there. That's where we came down this morning. I don't know if you can see the wee path that takes across. There's a wee bypass path, so you don't have to go up over this. So we're on the summit of Neil Garb. I'm not sure if it's a corbett or if it's just a top. It's 800 and something. Um, and we come up steeply from down at the Bulac there, and that's Malachkor McFerrihy um, 
and the kind of ridge went along the summits. I think, well, I don't know where the summit is, up there somewhere. Um, and that's Ben Tarson, our first Munro, and a Vagin, and Ruth Stagmore. It's so just lovely. And the views are just gorgeous. That Sleoch up there. Um, Ridge looks amazing. You can see right out to sea. Had hot chocolate, and um, that's us finished the walk. It's about um, ten past seven, so I think we, we've been back for about an hour. Um, so it's pretty cold actually, it's really cold. It's almost June as well, but it's so cold. But that loch is just beautiful. That's Loch Anfada. Someone's camped on the beach right at the other end, and my tent is up behind that man there. So I'm going to get cosy in the tent and um, have a wee look at the photos I took. And I've got this river to cross. There's some stones um, just, just under the water, so I managed to get across. Hopefully I won't fall. Oops, it's kind of a bit dodgy in actually. Oh, oh, oh! Right in the river, right in the river. Oh, not totally. Boots are pretty waterproof actually. There we go. There's another wee tent there as well. It's got quite busy. Saturday night. No trace as always, just a few feathers and the rain's on and the hills are all claggy. So I'll finish up the video here. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! You saying bye Anne? Oh, bye! Hi. <laughs> see you later, bye!